All right, folks. I am back live with some more House Flipper. Um, I told you I'd be going between it and the Lumberjack Dynasty because I'm liking both games. <coughs> um, so we're going to get started here on this. I've got a house here I think I just purchased, if I remember correctly, and we're going to try to uh, work on this house and get this house ready to be flipped. Um, so... Uh, do want to say too thanks to all of those who are new to the channel uh, we're now up to 97 followers we're getting there um, we're gonna eventually get to that hundred mark uh, so let's get this uh, see if we can get this house fixed and get it up and running and ready to flip so we can make some more money uh, really have been um, uh, guess what you could say is we really been getting into this simulation game um, it's really been something that we've been our go, our go to okay so that's the first office burned house okay so the, yeah this is the house we're going to work on here is the burned house <coughs> yeah so we're going to work on this one a little bit Because the first one we did was a bungalow. Okay, I want to make sure I was right before I click the buttons here. <coughs> I don't know what in the world. I've got a cough this morning. Or this afternoon, whichever you want to call it. If I remember correctly, we went ahead and took out some things in this so we could already have an idea of what we wanted to do. Um, this place is a mess, though, I can tell you that right now. Um, yeah, so we had done cleaned, yeah, we done cleaned a bunch of this up. So we were, uh, trying to get this ready. So we got this going on here. Okay, so when we come in, well, you know, I want to sell that. Y'all have to bear with me just a minute. I'm still using controls from... Um, from the Dynasty game, which by the way I will be streaming in just a little while, but I really wanted to get this one so we can continue on with this simulator game as well. I, I'm <coughs> beginning to begin, 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 that's all folks. But I'm beginning to say that simulation games is probably the way I'm going to go for the most part. Uh, simulation is, I don't know, just, I'm really enjoying this. Um, so, trying to work on some of these outlets here to make sure that they are repaired and ready to go. <coughs> How was your coffee, babe? It's good. So there's well, still more over there. I made sure I made a whole pot full. Okay. Yeah, she likes her coffee. And it's always better when you make it. I don't know why. And the sad it's part like is, folks, what y'all don't understand is, I don't like coffee. <laughs> I don't even drink coffee. And she tells me it, I'm doing a good job on making coffee, but I don't even drink coffee, so I wouldn't even know if it was good or not. Well, you know enough about me to know that if it was bad, I would be, like, not drinking it. Yeah, if it was bad, she wouldn't drink it. I will give her that. Okay, we wanted to put a door here on this wall <clears throat> because we wanted to <coughs> open the bathroom from this side instead of into the kitchen like they originally had it. Um, it'd have been different if it had been like a hallway separating them, but they're not. So we just want to go with. We 
want to go with the um, bathroom, open it up more toward the living room, or maybe a bedroom, depending on the situation here. But I want the door of the place to be right here. I keep hitting the wrong buttons. I, I'm, I'm, that's crazy. Where I'm, I played the lumberjack thing, I just keep hitting the wrong buttons. All right, let's, let's see if we can figure this out here. Uh, bad, 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 bad. Nope, I was in the right spot the first time. Doors. And I need a, a door for walking into the bathroom. Did you say a walking dead bathroom? For walking into the bathroom. Into oh, ba I thought into you said a walking dead bathroom. I was like, are you serious? Uh, no. That wouldn't happen. I was like, I'm not going to the bathroom. Uh, neither would I. I'll pee in my pants. I'll be alright. I'll go outside. So this will probably be, okay. I'll put the door more over here toward that. Alright, so. <clears throat> One, two, three, four maybe. <coughs> We're gonna try and see what's the worst you can do about work. I'm a gummy bear. I'm a gummy bear. Yummy, 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 gummy bear. I'm a gummy bear. I'm a gummy bear. Okay, so, yeah. <clears throat> now we've got hit the wrong button again. lists get over there build that section this whole section here also we can have there's not enough room to place a wall here yeah there is see there was too all right so let's go in here this is going to be the bathroom and since this is the smallest room so far uh, I'm probably going to work on that so this is where the commode was at this is where it looks like maybe a shower was at, was there. The sink was over here, but we're going to put the sink over. We're going to put the sink over here. <coughs> and, um... Yummy, yummy in your tummy, kind of gummy bear. I'm a gummy bear. I'm a gummy what in the bear. world would make you think to sing about that song today? Yummy, yummy, yummy in my tummy, gummy bear. I'm a gummy bear. Are you wanting gummies or something? No. I don't know. I just thought a yummy gummy bear. <laughs> okay, I just... I guess Chloe's talking about the little um, Charmin bear earlier. Oh... Where do I find... Okay, there it is. For... My honey's clean. It's charming clean. Okay, so this... Yeah, this is the sink plumbing. I was trying to figure out where you go to buy the... For the sink. Installations. Yeah, it took me a moment to figure that out. Alright, so we're going to put that there. Well, while we're already in here, let's go ahead and work on the bathroom and get it up and ready to go. And, uh... <clears throat> Oops, wrong one. Bath and showers. Let's see, there's the toilets. Do you ever, um, when you're playing this game, do you ever... Do you ever, um, get any of the more expensive toilets? I have... I mean, does it make a difference? I mean, realistically? I don't think so. No, not really. It's just for looks, I guess. Yeah. Okay. I was just kind of curious because I didn't know if maybe, if maybe there was a difference. I've never it. sold a house and then be like, "Ooh, I bought the house because you had a bidet." No. 
No. Never. I just fix it like I would like it if I was living in it. And if they don't like it, then they don't have to buy it. That's the only well, realistically, way I wouldn't that be way really a person should fix the house? Yeah, like I was going to have it. Well, I mean, unless than you was... I mean, I could see if you was, um... I could see if you was, like, um... Building it for somebody's specification, you know what I'm saying? Well, but, not only that, but depends on, like, too, in real life. In real life. Not in the game, but in real life. What spectrum you're trying to build it to. Like, if you're in a... A lake house that's gonna you would bring in hundreds of thousands of dollars and up close to the quarter million, three quarter million dollar price tag, you would want all high end stuff in it. Yeah. Because they're not gonna pay that for Maytag. <laughs> I mean, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you gotta get the, the really good stuff, which Maytag is a good name, but. Sure. If I like that color. Oh, no, I definitely know I don't want that. No. And I've learned too that lighter colored walls. And another thing I learned is paint the whole house in the same color. If you do white, do the whole house white. If you do beige, do the whole house beige. Now, once it has like two different floors, you got a basement and an upper floor. I'll do two different colors, but the basement's all one color, the upper floor's all one color. Because I tried to do like different colors in all the rooms and stuff one time, and I kept getting criticized for, it's, it was, boy, it's extremely colorful, ain't it? So I was like, okay, they don't like color. That's crazy because I've done the same thing, but, um,. I've done the same thing as far as, but I've changed it. I actually have changed the color of the stuff. You know what I mean? Yeah. And for some reason, they've not really complained about it. Really? Because the, I, I did a house and they was like, we're not trying to buy the rainbow and it's really? sure it's extremely colorful. And yeah, as I've not like, had that there's way yet. too much color in there or so I was like that. I just started doing like all one all color of my, all of my rooms are different colors I color now when I different. did when I did the basement the other day I did it in a bold blue like two different color blue but it was like stripes in the room yeah. on one wall I just did one wall like an accent wall <clears throat> and and they got a bid more over it and I made like sixty thousand dollars on that house so I mean, well, I mean, I guess it just depends on the individual. But I, I'll be honest with you, I have, I've not had that experience yet. Like, the experience I've had so far has been, everybody for the most part really does. Seem and there's to, one guy that always says, walls in a house need to be white. So. I, I painted a house with all white walls, and, well, he didn't get it. Oh, uh, so you really wasted your... Mm-hmm. I got you. I got you. I always do mine different. That's wild. It really... Is. So I just started doing whatever color I feel like. Like the other day when I did that beach house, I did it in sea, that sea foam beach color that they had. I did the main floor in it, and then when I went downstairs in that part where it had the, uh, where I made the game room and I made bedrooms down there, because there was no bedrooms in that house, I made bedrooms in it. And when I did that, it went over well, but I did the, the bottom floor like a, a cream color, a kind of a creamish brownish looking color. And then I did the upper floor in that sea foam bluish green color. And it sold really well. But I showed you that bedroom. I mean, it was, I had navy blue. I went with a bold, and I thought, I don't know if I 
if I'm going to shoot myself in the foot or, but that one actually sold good because I did the baby blue on all the walls and then that one accent wall I did, navy blue. Yeah, um, I, I've always said since the, since the other house I did, I did automatically, I went ahead and done, um, a different on the every room kind of thing. Mm-hmm. Because I don't feel like every room should look the same. Otherwise, it becomes just kind of bland, you know, um, as far as color Of course, goes. now in my bathrooms, I do um, tile from floor to ceiling, pretty much. But I try to match them with the main floor. Like if I did tan or cream, I'll try to do a light tone in the bathroom to keep the flow maybe that the makes a difference floor. maybe it's more about the the maybe it's more about that than it is anything else kind of keeping the same tone yeah and not but, having I mean, like it's not the soul. exact same color but it's the same feel it, yeah it'll it, like it'll all be neutral or all be bold or it'll all be that's what I try to do that's me personally I'm watching the names flip above my head as they are changing who is like in the, uh, at the top and who's at the, you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And usually the person that's on the top that likes it doesn't get it. Lots of pins up, yeah. Have you noticed it? Well, some, yeah, because sometimes that old lady names the ones that's always on top of me. Well, yeah, they was at first, like the first several houses, but now they're starting to get outbid um, on a lot of houses. And I noticed that old lady, that old man, I've been noticing in their post when they do get a house, they're talking about renting some of this stuff. And I'm thinking, I just fixed a higher end house for you to rent and may wind up having to go back in and do later because you're not going to clean it. If you didn't clean the first 500, you're not going to clean that one either. But they keep me in business, so. It's hard to complain about job security. Okay, so for the most part, this bathroom, um, other than putting a few decorations in here, which is what I'm fixing to do, is pretty much done, I think. And putting some light fixtures in and things like that. <clears throat> most of them I always go for this cheap mirror. I've altered the mirrors. You can rotate them too and give them a different look and a different function uh, based on how your sink looks. Like some of the long triangle ones look better turned sideways. Some of them look better straight up and down. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And then there's one mirror in there that literally you could build a wall out of. It's from floor to ceiling. I thought about maybe building like a mirror wall one day in the bathroom and see how it does. Like just do one accent wall and mirrors. Mm -hmm. I think that's going to be brightening up in here. Okay. <clears throat> My toe is hurting something fierce. 
I did a black wall the other day just as an accent wall and I did the rest of it all white and I did one black and it did not look good. I wound up ch changing it back to white. It made the room really dark and it felt like it was boxed in. So I wound up changing it. It wasn't really black. It was really, I think it was like a dark, dark navy. But I didn't like it. Now the navy I did down in that basement, it looked good. <laughs> <sighs> my foot is hurting. I took me some time off, but my goodness. And there's this one lady on there, too, that's constantly saying that the houses are clean. But she don't say it when they're actually clean. She says it when they're a mess. Yeah, really. I know. I'm like, that lady's crazy. Like, I think she's smoking crack or been hanging around some like wrong crowd or something doing something because i'm telling you what some of them houses are not clean mm -mm. no there'll be roaches in the floor and puke in the bathroom from head to toe and she's like oh that house is so clean i'm thinking i don't know what you're living in but uh if this is clean don't ever call me because i don't want to clean yours Yeah, really. It's one of those houses that you'd have to wear um, one of those big, huge masks in and <laughs> a hazmat suit. <laughs> See. You'd think they had ET in there while, and all you was doing is just cleaning. Colored you go with? Oh, in the bathroom. <coughs> <coughs> Some of the people that asked me to paint when I was like doing the email jobs, they wanted some weird colors. The bathroom and, went with a black and white tile. Okay, on the floor. Uh, uh, or the whole thing. The, the walls, the. Okay. <sighs> yeah. Yeah, um...
tired of fishing. Go find something else to do. I need to check my tomatoes. Cook my fish and go sell it. Oh wow, I got 24 of them this time. I love how it only takes just a few seconds to cook all 24 of them. Yeah, that really, that's that's pretty neat. You're not standing there slaving away for 15 hours. I hope the cows are easy to milk when we get them. I think they will be. Everything's been fairly simple. Yeah, I kind of. When I get through this, I'm going to go to that game because I really, I really like that game. I need to find some seeds. I still hadn't found a place selling seeds. I found one the other day, but I can't. I can't. I can't remember off the top of my head. So I can't really just like. I know, tell you. like, t yeah. I know that crazy lady that was on the hill sold was selling stuff. I haven't been able to find her since the first time. Apple trees ain't, they've just, okay. they've just stopped producing altogether. I got my scarecrow out there, so, yeah, birds got, ain't eating it. Yeah, I've got mine too. I'm not sure exactly what's what there. This is the whale, ain't it? Yup. Yup. It sure is. Alright, so, here's, I want some chickens. Let's see, I've got, I need three more thousand to get that truck. I really need that truck. That'll, I'll start making money then. Let mm. me walk up here to the store and sell what I've got. Then I might run a mission. So for the most part, folks, this bathroom is complete. I need to sell this. I like this store, too, because this dude's always up here. He never sleeps. He's open 24-7. He must be zombie. I don't think he's really human. I'm out. That is... I'm trying to pick a color for that. Well, I'm looking for go. Ugh. Does he have seeds? I don't think bit. he sells seeds. He has a 
He has a uh, weed whacker. Weed eater. Okay, so what we're going to do here... A shovel and a rake. Is I'm going to put a wall, and I know we took it down, but I'm going to put a wall. A drone. Because the winder is here. So I'm going to go ahead... Let's do something here. Why? Uh, because it can. Okay, so what I'm doing is here, I'm literally, there's a wardrobe, uh, ooh, that max, matches that, so let's go with that. I'm literally um, matching this one with that one, let's give it some black, there we go, some dark handles, and we're just going to put this bad boy right here, if I can get it there like that okay so that's that <laughs> so what I'm gonna do is it's so dark in here you can't see this using the headlamp um, what I'm gonna do is here is I'm gonna do something interesting you okay he just gave me the farm Who did? he said we could split it 50 50 until it's paid for and it's mine <clears throat> Like, yeah. He said, I've been watching you and you got the strength for it and the skill and So what we've done is we've now made the, this room a little bit smaller. So we've made a bedroom here. Uh, I mean, it's not very big. The house is not very big either. But we have got a double size bed in here. So it's two people. It's a two people bed. So that makes a difference there. So that's yeah. That's going to be. I like that. All right. So whoops. So what we need to do is now is we need to get a door on this. Uh. Let's get a door. And since we've already used one, where's it at? This one, I'm going to go with this one just because the fact it runs with the same thing that we already have going on in the house. Alright, so let's open up the door. Uh, and that wasn't a hallway, dude, so I don't know what you're talking about when you said no expensive furniture in the hallway. That's not a hallway. Uh, Alright, so let's look at the flooring here. Do they have like carpets? Yes, they do. Um, well, I've got a red bedspread. Alright. Y'all just bear with me. Don't kill me on this one. I'm just going to test this out and see what happens. If we don't like it, if it ain't like I can't change it again. Um, but, no, I like that. Okay. Um, if you know anything about me, I like the color red. And my... Get in there. Why would that... There it goes. I opened up a door. All right. I like red, and my wife likes this blue color. So I, I'm, I fixed this room. It's got almost that kind of color. Now, the walls are not going to be that color. That'd be kind of strange unless I did some kind of like 
back and forth. Wallpapers? They got wallpapers in the game? Well, where is that being at? There's dinosaurs on the wallpaper. Okay, I'm not using the wallpapers. I never think they look too pretty most of the time. Never been a fan of really big wallpapers anyway, not even in real life. Uh, I'm just going to go with paint. Paint is, paint is awesome. Paint is your best friend. With all else fails, paint. Um, fresh carrot color? Ugh. We're going to try this color um, and just see what happens. That's the worst it can do. Not look good. And we're going to start here and work our way across. I'll be honest with you, I don't mind the color, really. I'm kind of glad I went with the choice. We're such precision painters, we don't even get paint nowhere. No drips, no splatters, no nothing. how we do it.
Okay, so we have literally, oh, almost. We have almost completely painted this room here. So, now we've got it painted. All right. All right, so we've got the room painted. So we've got the bedroom worked on. Um, Okay, so we've done that. So, alright, now we got to put up some um, light in here. We need some light. So, let's go with lights, ceiling. I'm going to run with this theme in all the, in all the rooms. This just needs one. It's so powerful anyway. Where's the light switch? Do we have a light switch? We do not. Okay. That lets me know I need a light switch. So let's do this. Grab this. And when you come in the door, let's stick it right there. So we can, There we go. See, that's what that... Yeah. That light was just enough that lit up that whole entire room. So that's good. Uh... Okay, so we need, I'm going to do lights anyway, because I want to put a table lamp. And in this one, I'm going to use this, I think. I'm going to go with a medium size, depending on how big a medium is. No, it's perfect. And we're going to set that in the middle there, on there. Oh yeah, I like that. Oh, those decorations come in. I don't remember some of these decorations. Is it like every time you upgrade or something or every time you do something like new stuff comes in? since we're going let's do this space how big is the space is it pretty big no it's not I don't like it okay let's do
Okay, so what we need to do is here. Okay, this is what we're going to do. I'm going to pull this out. Okay. And we're going to do windows. Not, not that one. You know what? I'm going to leave it just like that leave that one window there and I'm gonna put a picture up there that's what I'm gonna do and let's do a painting Right, let's go with this and then go with furniture we're going to go with the living room we're going to go with shelves we're going to put us a shelf on the wall here if i can find one that i particularly like that's a bookcase but i bet you anything that'll stick out too far Actually, it's not bad. It's not bad. I'm supposed to collect mushrooms for Lily, but I have nowhere. I don't have no clue where to go. That's the way it works normally. Okay. So, what I'm going to do is, I'm going to try to deck, hopefully decorate that bookshelf if it's possible. I don't know if it is or not, but we're going to find out. Great. What have I got myself into? Wild mushrooms, I need 50 of them. Okay, so we do have books, books here. I don't see any. And you can put them on there. Any. Okay, so let's do, um, let's do this book set and let's go with a large. Okay, so that won't fit there. And 
neither will that one. Okay. So what we'll do is we'll put some here on this shelf. We'll put a little bit on this side. Over there. Um, and the reason being is because what I'm going to do is... Well, that's too big. Yeah, okay, so that one works better. Yeah. Wow, I was thinking, man, that's huge compared to what I really wanted to stick there. So there's that. Um, let's go with a small plant. Let's do this. Let's do a base that. Will this work? That's the question though. Will it fit on that shelf? Yes, yes it will. Okay, so that worked. that one's a little bit big I do want to do this let's put this down there on the bottom shelf okay
Okay, so for the most part, this bedroom is complete. Um... got the shelf shelves is in a weird location under furniture you know what I mean wow that's way too big is it a smaller one That's good enough. Oh wow, that's too big. That is way too big for what I was wanting. Um, I was hoping it's going to be smaller than that. But this is going to be too big too. Actually, I could put that right there. Move this picture up. Like that. Okay. Yeah, I think that's going to work better. Okay, so there's that. This room, as simple as it is, it's just simple, quaint, doesn't have to have a whole lot in here. Um, so I think with that being said, folks, uh, we have officially finished this little bedroom and we have finished the... Uh, The bathroom as well on this episode which is pretty cool we got both of those done I didn't know whether we was going to be able to or not um, but we did so I just wonder something if I did this how big would that stick out there we're gonna do it we're, just gonna, we're gonna do it we're gonna go for it why not Yeah, I got room to get through there. Okay, so um, it's that time again. So I do hope that you've enjoyed uh, the episode. I hope that you've enjoyed what you've seen. Uh, if you haven't already, make sure to find us uh, right here on 
Facebook, the Holt Network. You can also find me on Twitter and YouTube as well. All the videos will be uploaded to YouTube at a later date so that way you can go back and enjoy all the content. And, of course, donations are welcome. The information at the bottom of the screen. Be sure to follow me right here on Twitch as well so you can stay up to date with when I go live with new content. Uh, but we have finished this bedroom and we have finished um, this little room in here, the bathroom. Uh, we've got these two rooms completed and uh, our next thing will be is tackling a kitchen and a living room area here in this space right here and we'll do that in the next episode and with that being said folks I will catch you all in the next one right here on House Flipper. Catch you later.